All right, so a lot of people are using milkweed as their wind indicator. And I've seen a lot of suggestions online for the best way to carry it from bags and pouches to just using the actual milkweed pod as a dispenser. None of them really worked well for me, but I found a way that I really like to dispense my milkweed. And I'm gonna show you a really simple way to do it at home. So this is a very simple method and all you're going to need is obviously milkweed, latex gloves, scissors, and some kind of tube. I use this cardboard tube that actually came on some like camo form tape that I bought and it works absolutely perfect. You want something that's around this size is probably about an inch or inch and a half in diameter. And I'll show you what that's used for in just a second. All right, so the first step to this process is you are going to take one rubber glove and you're gonna cut a finger off of it. The middle finger tends to be the best because it's the longest and skinniest, but I'll cut off all the fingers off of this rubber glove. The middle three are the best by far. All right, so right there, I've got three fingers cut off of a rubber glove. You could also use something called finger cots that are sold at most drugstores or on Amazon, but I already had rubber gloves, and so the cheapest way to do this was just to cut a finger off. So take the finger of that glove and you're gonna fold it back on itself. And then I'm gonna take my cardboard tube here and I'm gonna stretch this finger over that tube. So now I've got a tube and the tube is holding open the finger of that rubber glove. And you want it to be about halfway back. You still want some length out here that's not under tension. Basically what this tube is gonna do is just hold it open and make it really easy for you to just shove a whole bunch of milkweed in one of these fingers. So I have a bag here of milkweed that I collected this past year. And it will be a mess, so don't do this inside if you're gonna get in trouble for making a mess in your house. But you're gonna take handfuls of milkweed and then you're just gonna take this and shove it inside the tube. Now, each of these can hold quite a bit of milkweed, so you just stuff it so that there's a lot of tension on it at the end and compress it all into the tip of the finger and you don't want any remaining in the tube. I don't know if you can see that there. You can see it's all down in the finger of the glove and none left in the tube. And then what I'm gonna do is twist that and take that off of the tube and you'll end up with just a little kind of ball of milkweed. Then you're gonna tie off the back. Which is the hardest part. So in the end you are left with what looks like a pouch of milkweed. You're gonna take the scissors and very carefully cut just a little sliver. So generally I make a handful of these between five and 10 at the beginning of the season. Each one of these lasts numerous hunts, you know, four or five hunts. Um, and I'm a pretty heavy user of milkweed. And then I'll keep one on the shoulder strap. There's a little pouch for a Windicator. You can keep it in your bino harness, you can keep it in your pocket, keep one inside your pack. And it's nice because it basically, until you get all the way down, you can just pinch it and uh, pull out just the right amount of milkweed. <sighs> Works really well. And then as it gets low, you kind of just like toothpaste, you wanna squeeze it back up to the top so you can keep dispensing because once it gets down to the bottom and there's too much slack in there, it won't work anymore. Hope that's a helpful tip for you guys. Thanks for watching.